Hey guys, welcome to episode 2 of my Sonic Mania Let's Play, where we're going to be tackling the Flying Battery Zone with Knuckles. The Flying Battery Zone. It's Flying Battery Zone. I'm not going to be that type of dude. Oh god. All the friggin' cockroaches. Uh, what are they called? Electric mice? I can't remember. They have a name, but I can't remember what it is. It's something obscure and kind of stupid. Techno Rat. Or Techno Mouse, something like that. Techno something. There's so many of them. And they're so hideous. They have really weird eyes. So the first thing I'm going to do is run over here and grab the fire shield just to make life a little bit easier for myself. And then we're going to get on with the level. So I assume that like most levels this is going to be stupidly easy because I now have Knuckles. And guess what Knuckles can do people? He can glide. He can glide. He can literally turn the entire part concept of the stage into, well, useless. Because I can glide. Do you know why? Because I'm fucking Knuckles. Unlike Sonic, I don't fucking chuckle. Oh, that is like the dumbest thing that I think anyone's ever said. Hey, what's over here? Never been here before. Um, what's the lightning shield do? Oh, cool. Hey, that was an extra life. Uh-huh. Nope. Of course. Why would I be able to jump up here? Nope. Damn it! Curse you, you friggin' rhino. With a cannon on your snout. We're gonna cheese this area, too. If you manage to climb all the way up here and start gliding. And somehow make it to the other side, you can actually get that extra life. We're going to get that extra life. Somehow. Ah! Okay. So, um... Yeah, it probably wasn't the smartest thing to do. Neither was that. I mean, come on, let's be real. Knuckles would be dead by now. What just happened? I am confused. No. No destroying me. Hey, look. <laughs> I don't even need tails for this part. Wait, what? Well, that sucks. I managed to get all the way up there just enough to hit the second. Oh, no. That also wasn't smart. That's not smart. Nope. Ah ha ha! How to get wrecked as Knuckles. No. No! No, Jesus Christ. I need rings. I need rings. I need rings. Thank you. I don't want to die. I'm probably going to. I don't want to. I'm probably going to. We have nine lives so far, so we're doing good. Hey, look, we made it to the boss. The boss that we can probably... Aww, that sucks. And now I have to wait a little bit longer, because Knuckles can't jump as high. Great. It's turned into hard mode. Uh, what to do? I wonder if I could find a game of chess in here. Maybe I could fix that computer monitor. Play Tetris. I don't know. Hey, maybe I could build a friend out of all these pieces. I'll name him George. George, why? Hey, look, we can finally start hitting the thing. That will apparently shock you once it starts powering up. <clears throat> but at least we didn't get crushed. Now, if I can just climb out of here. Which apparently isn't allowed. You know, at least it's nice to know that Eggman... Um, recycles. I mean, at least he keeps flying batteries on around to carry his junk.
We. Hey kids, guess what? I know where there's a special emerald stage on this zone too. Actually, I know where there's a few. And we're gonna go explore them. Don't be afraid to drop down here. It's okay. You make your way over to the special stage, which will give you 50 rings. Also, um, unlike last time, no, 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 no. Darn. Can't get the friggin' extra life. I can never get the extra life. And now I have to do all the climbing up here to get... Ugh. Why does nothing ever go my way? Go that way. Also, you do not need to destroy all the electrodes on those things. You just need to destroy the mole guy who's controlling them. And then they won't fire you anymore. You can destroy them all because, I mean, you know, they act as, like, obstacles to you jumping. But you don't necessarily have to. To prevent them from attacking you. Just destroy them all, guy, and you're good. Also, I wonder if they can hurt you while you have an electric shield. I don't know. Good question. I guess not. Huh. Well, something to keep track of. Expert piloting. Well, at least it's nice to note that the uh, mental shields do things other than just collect rings. And give sonic attacks. Like now the magnetic or now the electric shield makes you magnet magnetize. The fire shield actually burns things. The water shield turns you into bubble man. Okay, if there was actually a spring under there and you took it, you would literally die. You would be destroyed by getting propelled through all that metal. Of course, this is a Sonic game, so what am I talking about? Eh, there we go. Of course, then again, swimming in scrap metal isn't exactly my idea of a good time, so. I prefer to swim in blood of my enemies. Go this way. Destroy you. No thanks for you. No! Go into that thing. Also, why do they have, why does Eggman have a flamethrower there? Like, what, what is the point of that? Yay! I'm not dying. Like, what is the point of that? Are they literally just there because you didn't want to make spring sprites? Like, you have springs. You could just you could just easily replace them with springs. What is the purpose of there being a flamethrower there? What does it serve? Hey, look, we made it to the boss. And now we're going to cheese this boss. Hopefully. Nope. Apparently not. Nope. Come on. Crap. This boss might be harder to cheese than the other ones. Nope. Not getting crushed. Nope. 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 Why didn't you do the thing? Hey, cool. <laughs> Damn it. Nope. Nope. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down, damn it. You're not allowed to live, Eggman. No. 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 That wasn't what I was trying to do. No. No. 
No. Stay down. No. No. Get damaged. And stay dead, you fucking spider. I don't like spiders. Get back here! <sighs> oh well. I guess we'll just have to kick his ass in the next zone. Until then, I will see you guys in the next episode when we tackle Press Garden. Peace.